you know let me tell you two things many people come in your life with the aim of putting you to shame with the aim of you know folding you with the aim of you know like destroying your joy your happiness with the aim of putting you know a uh, danger or making you to become so scared of them but today many of them are scared of you because all that all that they have did you know you have a lot of people who have thrown a lot of dramas you have a lot of people who just wake up in the morning who just pick their call all that they just want to say all that they just want to do is just how to provoke you how to make you come to the point of becoming what angry but what shocked them is that they, your joy is not taken. The more they do, the more they realize that you are filled with joy. You are filled with happiness. You are filled with hope. And it's something that is driving them crazy. And it's something that is what that is driving their life insane. Because their mindset was to do what? Was to make sure they fold your life. Was to make sure nothing work out for you as long as they live. Their mindset was to make sure you live a life of regret as long as they live. Their thought was to make sure you go through the worst in your entire life. But right now, they are going through exactly what they were hoping that you will go through. This is to tell you how marvelous our God is. Now they are the one that is so scared of you. Now they are the one that is being terrified. Now they are the one that is being what, you know, being devastated. Because their mind was that, ah, after dealing with you, after doing this to you, you will surely fold. That thing that makes you strong, you will end up becoming so weak. That thing that makes you strong will end up becoming so weak. That you will not be able to stand them. You will not be able to be focused. You will not be capable to do what God has called you to do. That is why the Bible said the weapons of our welfare are not kind of but my true God. Pulling down the strongholds. Casting down imagination. Bringing into captivity every turn to the obedience of Christ. So believe me choosings. They are absolutely embarrassed. Because they have now fully come to see the glory of the father manifesting earnestly in your life they have not fully come to understand whom you are as a chosen so it's something that is embarrassing them because they have not end up going through what they thought you will go through they have not end up going exactly the same thing that they were hoping that you will face they are not the one that is so scared of you choosing because let me tell you people who are scared of you right now have tried all means to make sure you end up because so scared of them people who are terrified by you today have end up trying their best putting in their best effort to make sure you become so scared of them but what shocked them is that you are too what you are too powerful to become so scared of garbages you are too what you are too protected to become so scared of losers and this is why they don't like you this is why they are angry why do you ought to lead them or why do you ought to be so powerful that they yourself now are scared of you you know what i'm saying so remember blessing god bless you